Hi everyone, today I'm going to do a what's in my bag video. Um, so I'll get started. I love these kind of videos and watching the people's. I have got this bag here and I think it was from Fashion World and looks like this. Got gold studs on and this and then it's got this lovely strap with the studs here and the tassels. I love this bag, it's really nice, it's really soft and it holds so much. I'll show you the inside. I'm taking everything out of it. And it's got a zip pocket here and then space for your whatever you hold here and then space for your phone in this one here. <coughs> also when I do what's in my bag videos, it means that I can have a good clear out of what's in my bag. So first is my purse. Um, this is just a Patrick Cox purse. It's a long one. And I just keep all my receipts and cards and stuff to one side. And the next thing I carry with me is my inhaler. This is a new one um, because my other one was old. I tried to put my name on it and my number, but it's all worn off now, so I have to put that in again. Another thing I carry with me, I've only just picked this up actually, I got this free with a magazine, Jergens Ultra Healing Nourishes and Heals Body Moisturiser. This is really good. I might, might get another, another one of these. I wish they could just like give you small parts so you can carry them around with you. Oh, actually I thought this was just a body moisturiser. Oh, I thought it said for your heels, but it says that it actually heals dryness at the source of visibly healthier skin. Um, it smells really nice. It smells a bit like suntan lotion, but it's very nice. I love it. Next, I carry with me a relief cream, Blistex, and in fact, I didn't even know I carried this with me or I would have used it more. It was in one of, like, deep down in one of my pockets. Next is a pen that is broken. It hasn't got anything in it, so I'm going to throw that away. <laughs> But I do carry with me this pen here. It's a pink one. I think it's from Clinton's, I think. But yeah, and a Barclays one. Everyone has a Barclays pen with them. And my diary, which I cannot live without. I don't know where this is from. I got this from my boyfriend's mum for Christmas and I carry it everywhere. I always have it. I love it because it's small, it's thin, it fits perfectly into my bag. And the, uh, the way the days are, I just like this. I like it because it's girly, it's got lilac flowers and butterflies on it, it's really nice. And then I found a nail varnish, which I think I left at my friend's house and um, they kindly gave me it back. It's one of the George nail varnishes, quick dry nail varnish, it's in like an orange colour. These nail varnishes are really good, especially if you're looking for a specific colour to go with your outfit. They're only like a pound or something from George and they're really good. I like them. Good value for money. Got a long hairband here. I think that's for when I had a bun in, like my donut bun. It's really stretchy. It's really good. It does kind of tear your hair a bit because it's got kind of like a, an elastic band to it here. If you can see that. I'm not sure if you can. And then another hair bubble. I'm always losing these. I've got one around my wrist. There's one here. It's a lighter brown colour. I like to keep one of those with me. Got some earphones which I keep in my bag and that's got my iPod. <clears throat> in fact, I've only just found my iPod, it was in the boot of my car because it was with my uh, gym stuff and this is to go around your, your arm. So I carry with me all the time a nail file. This one here, it's glittery, it's golden like a, a greeny lime colour. Then and I haven't used it actually, I always carry it around with me though. A receipt, as to price receipt, um, panty liner, always comes in useful, um, some paracetamol, I should carry these around with me all the time, however recently I've got a perforated eardrum, it really hurts, and so I'm having to carry with me ibuprofen, paracetamol and my antibiotics. So I'm running low on these. <laughs> um, next I have 4p and 5p and I picked two pence up off the floor. <laughs> and then I've got lots of paper here. I'm not sure where these are all from. I should probably keep some.
I don't know what they are. I'll sort them out later. Another receipt. Thank you, Samuel. I don't know why somebody's put at the end of your receipt when you're paying and it says, thank you, Samuel. What does that mean? I don't know. Strange. And then I have this, which is a sample. It's called Romantic Walnut and it's a sample of a kitchen unit, uh, the kitchen tops it's from Wix because me and my boyfriend are buying a house and so a lot of the things that I have with me the, to do with the papers are all to do with the house and in the process of buying it and things so we just, I didn't realise you could take a sample of like the work surfaces but this is what a sample I've got. And the next bits are my three lip glosses and lipstick. This one is a MAC lipstick and this is Lustre Jubilee. I think it says Jubilee. I'm not sure because it's kind of worn off at the sides. And this one is bro all my lipsticks are breaking at the moment. Just like a nude lipstick I put a bit on now because it's really nice. And soft. Oh, I can't put it on because it's broken. It's annoying that I'm going to have to take them off the thing and put it into a container and just use like a stick. And then this one is vanilla birthday cake and this was uh, from a friend for my birthday. It's, oh, delicious. You can actually like eat it. I don't know if you can actually eat it, but I mean, if you do lick your lips, you don't get the aftertaste of it being quite sour and bitter. It's really nice. High gloss, high flavour lip shine. Um, ultra brilliant ingredient. I'm not saying anything about eating it, but I've been eating it. <laughs> not actually eating it, but it's just really nice. I like this lip gloss. And then I've got this one, which is also, it tastes great. This is a pink one. This is by Butter London Lippy. And I actually got this from TK Maxx. And I got it with uh, one of the glitter nail varnishes that are kind of the similar colour as this. Um, to show you what it looks like. And it smells, this one smells like strawberries-ish. It smells like a strawberry milkshake. It smells delicious. So if you're in TK Maxx, I think they still sell these, like all different colours and stuff. So I carry those three around with me. And I also carry around, I don't know where I put it now. <laughs> it's like a, I don't know where it's gone. So I emptied all my bag and all the bits have just gone everywhere. It's like a, a Nivea lip butter. Um, that's buttercream cup or something like that. I forgot what it's called now, but it's really good. It's yummy. And then I have my sunglasses, which are fake Ray-Bans. <laughs> These ones I like because they're white, and I wanted some white ones. This is from last year, or two years ago or something. I really like these. And I carry these everywhere. I actually keep them. usually keep these in my car, but I've been wearing them out. So I kind of want two pairs now, but I want a black pair. So, yes, and that's everything that I've got in my bag. So, if any of you like doing videos like me, then please can you leave a video response, seeing what's in your bag. Um, yes, that's all for now. Might do another haul on a holiday, what I'm taking on holiday, because I'm going on holiday quite soon. And I might do a holiday haul or something, all the things that I've got, like, beauty-wise or product wise what I'm taking and because I'm moving house and looking into getting lots of different things curtains bedding materials and things like that so I might do one of those but that's probably a bit in the future for now so I hope that's okay and I'll see you later bye